Hello viewers, welcome to Elimu TV, a station where you watch and learn. I'm your tutor, Filari Siri. Today I'm going to take you through English from 2, lesson 20. Our topic will be on listening and speaking, and the subtopic will be on bowing and cutting. So I expect you to learn a student, by the end of the lesson, you'll be able to define what is bowing and what is cutting. And you can be able to differentiate between bowing and cutting. So we'll begin with the bowing from the word bow. This is a gesture of respect. People bow in many occasions such as the Catholics bow at the entrance or at the palpit as a sign of respect. In Maasai community, young children bow before adults as a sign of greeting as well as respect. We find out that uh, bowing is when someone tends to lower their heads before raising up their heads. We can see that this is done by many believers, especially the Catholics. Apart from that, in Maasai communities, uh, the young children do not greet do not greet the elders with their hands. Instead, what they do is that they bow and the and the elders tend to tap on their forehead as a sign of response. So we find out that these are two acts of respect. The second type is cutting. This is a gesture of respect that women use. While men bow, women curtsy. A woman bends her knees with one leg behind the other. If we talk of cutting, we can say this in most of the women. In the ancient times, we can say that in countries like Uganda, women bow before their husbands when they bring food or anything before their men. And so they do so by placing one leg behind the other, which is a sign of respect and commitment. Even young girls are taught to do that. So we can say men, young men tend to bow while women curtsy. Having us said that, you can check on the assignment and our assignment today will be so easy. Ask a partner or a friend and practice in turns bowing and curtsy. To check on this type of, to check on the bowing and curtsy, you can refer them to Excelling in English Series Book 2. Second edition, which is published by the Kenya Literature Bureau. You can also make inquiries to our, you can make inquiries or reach to us at our SMS numbers as posted. YouTube Elimu TV, Facebook Elimu TV, Twitter at Elimu TV underscore KE. Thank you for the lesson. Till another time.